In ROS2 documentation, we can easily see that it supports Java, Rust, Python, C++ and more. But the important thing is when we are actually developing any project specifically in C++, sometimes we need to do visualization quickly and at that specific point, we require Python in the same package to make things easier for ourselves and the team. But how do we do that? In this video, we will be looking into how to integrate libraries, how to integrate different language nodes in one package and also import different language libraries into specific nodes of those. Confusing, right? Let's take a look. I am in my workspace source directory. Let's create a package, ROS2 package we want to create. First of all, we need to define what is the build type. It is going to be C++ and Python nodes containing package. We need a CMake file which comes with C++ package. The name of the package is going to be multilang package just to understand what are the things happening. So this package has been created. It contains the CMake list. In source, there is nothing. Let's create a node cppublisher.cpp from the ROS wiki. We are going to bring up this code into our node and we will write here cpp topic. We need to make the additions into C make list and for that we have to provide information what are the libraries being involved in this C++ node. All of the explanation for that are already explained. Let's directly move to C make content and bring it side by side. I'll just copy it and bring these here. It basically tells RCL CPP and standard messages are two packages that we want in our node, which is publisher member.cpp. In our case, I have renamed it and it is going to be CPP node. And its dependencies are going to be RCL CPP and standard message. Let's build the package call can build. To run it, we need to perform sourcing and ROS to run multi-language CPP node, press enter, it is publishing. The next task is to add a Python node inside of it. It is tricky as most of the time we put all the things in source, but, but I practice to keep Python nodes in a different folder, in different directory and mostly I call it scripts. Let's go into our wiki and move towards simple Python publisher and subscriber example where we get this whole publisher of Python. Create a file and name it to be pynode.py. Bring in the whole code. Now to make this a node of this package, we have to tell inside of our CMake list that this specific file is also a node and it is very simple. Similar to install targets, we are going to write install programs and we have to provide the whole path as it starts from multi-lang package directory. We have source and CPP publisher. So for Python, it is going to be scripts forward slash name of our script which is pynode.py and it is going to copy it and put it in the same directory which is shared directory inside of your workspace with the package name. Let's make some distinguishable changes and call it to be pytopic and now let's perform call can build and we are now going to press double tab here and you can see we have cpp node and pi node as well so pi node dot pi press enter it says you have a certain error which is exec format error this error is not an actual logical error it is just to tell the system which version of python you are going to be using so let's open up pi node and we have to use a shebang that in this environment use python 3 again repeat the steps and run the node this time we can see a python node is also running if we stop this and a c plus node is also running inside of the same multi-lang package so in one package we have nodes of different languages for better understanding we are going to be adding libraries 
into both of these nodes one in python node and one in c both are performing same thing using open cv to create a black image and put a circle upon it now if i compile it right now it is going to give us an error because i have not added anything in the c make list and that is what you need to learn for now just going to build the python node not the c so i am going to comment this out which is regarding the C++ node and the other code remains the same. Let's perform call can build. Source it. ROS to run multi language package and we have two nodes c++ is the old one which just publishes the hello world message but this time the python node is newly compiled which deals with open cv related thing it is not printing anything but if i perform ros2 topic list you see the topic if i want to view any image that is currently being published ros i will use another package named as rqt ros2 run rqt image view and rqt image view press enter this package is utilized for viewing of the images pi topic and this is the image being published by python node now if i want to do the same thing and publish an image or mainly include a library which is open cv2 i have to do extra steps as compared to python in python i just imported it inside of the code and worked upon it but in c plus plus i have to tell that how you are going to find these include folders so in simple terms first one is sensor message that i want to include sensor message the second one is open cv and as i know the library folder directory is named as open capital cv with capital o as well then we have cv bridge as well Once we have found these packages, we are going to include them when we are building an executable for the node. As we did with RCL CPP, we are going to add sensor message, we are going to add OpenCV and the CV bridge when producing a compiled version. That's how it is going to find the required libraries of these included headers. Stop it and perform call can build. and then we are going to be now running cpp node press enter rqt image view this time if we take a look here it is published as vision topic so we will select the vision topic and the same image with the circle inside of it is represented the main point was how we are compiling and how we are finding the libraries for c plus plus we define everything inside of c make list where the packages are what are the packages and to which source code you are going to add these libraries and compile it and produce an executable in python everything is found with simple path if i just say import sys and print sys dot path all libraries that any library that i perform import for example numpy they are going to search in all of these and if not found then give error but otherwise it is going to go through all of these and find out that numpy named library is there or not so this was basic example of you to integrate two different language nodes into one package there are a lot of possibilities and different ways that you can do important thing for you to understand is the importance of c make list how to utilize it properly how to define things and cmake list actually only deals with c++ in its own package so most of the people are not aware of it but cmake list is a great tool for setting up the compilation execution and testing setup for c++ nodes